So now I think I can just go pretty much anywhere. A couple different spots. There's no point in going down there yet. Okay, went to the wrong door. Okay, so let's do this first before we have zombie trouble. So if I push it this way, I should be able to get on it here. So map of the mansion, I will take that please. and I'll take this. Yes, defensive item stuff. Is that all set in here? Yes. Now let's see if I can get past this zombie again. Ah, oh, Chris, no. Get up. Damn it. Okay, well. I'm not as lucky as I was with Jill. Locked and with sword. That's right, I forgot we got the sword tree there. Hmm. Well, there are only a couple places for me to go. Are there any unlocked doors up here? There are. I don't need to go out to the courtyard yet. No, I remember where I get the sword key, actually. Yeah. So, because of Chris's whole lack of inventory space thing, I'm gonna need to be a little bit, a little bit smarter than I was with Jill. I'm gonna need to think about what I pick up a little bit more. At least until I get access to the item boxes. Hold on, the game still might be... The game might actually be a little bit too loud. Maybe it wasn't at 30 before. Maybe it had it at, like, 25 or something. I don't know. I don't remember. It sounds weirdly loud to me. Uh... Let's see what this sounds like. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry about that. Take the Kenneth tape. Does Kenneth have anything else on him? Nope. I don't know why. I always think he has uh, handgun ammo, but he never does. He never does. Take you, take you. I don't know why I'm so yawny today. It's not like I had a bad sleep or anything. Or I've had a busy day. I certainly haven't had a busy day yet. So I don't know why I'm so full of yawns. I don't know. Maybe, maybe my sleep has been lackluster. Anything over here? No. There is not. Damn it. Hmm. I don't know. He did he did nibble on Chris quite a bit there. I'm I'm kinda thinking maybe Maybe that issue isn't fixed. Maybe that issue isn't fixed after all. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe my pro maybe it's weird. Maybe maybe my processor is literally just too fast. Oh, I don't know. That's strange, but 
Because I don't know, he did nibble on Chris quite a bit. Yes. Okay, let's see. If I just straight up button mash everything. Yeah, fuck me. Okay, yeah, so nah, I guess I guess there I guess there is still a problem with that. Well shoot. Ah man, that's a, that's really a shame. I was really hoping I could play. Do I need to make my processor slower? Is that really the only way to do it? I'll do it if I need to, but damn. It's only when they bite you, though. Like, th that's something I'm kind of noticing. It's not like when they hit you, it deals more damage. I'm pretty sure. I think it's only when they bite you. So that's more, or when they grab you. So that's more of a zombie problem. I guess I could, in theory, play Chris's on the. No, I won't. I won't. I won't play. I won't play Chris's on the on the GameCube. I was thinking I could, but, eh, you know, I don't really care that much, and I did get through it anyway. So, like as Jill. So it's not really a worry. It's just kind of annoying, and it's kind of sad because I was kind of, I was kind of thinking it might be, it would be nice to play through. Zero on the PC. But I don't want to do it if it still has the same issue. And if I need to... And the thing is, like, if I do need to, like, slow down my processor, I don't want to mess with that. I don't really want to do that. I don't see a, a point. It just kind of sucks, though. And it's not... I mean, there's probably fan patches. Oh, there's probably fan patches. You know what? I'm just curious. Let me... Let me just look this up. Let me just look this up really fast. I'll be very quick. I'll be very, very quick. RE1 Remake. Not Remail. Remake. Fan patches. That's PC gaming stuff. Uh... uh, uh. Uh, uh, no. This is all frame rate issues. Classic rebirth. So I don't know what this is actually about. For the original game. Oh. The HD remaster. Uh, so what do we have here? Saving him cloud sinking, blah, blah, blah. Fix his background music. SMAA, post processing. Green mapping. Uh, game fail start. No, it's not an issue that I have. Or performance and slowdown. It's not it. Yeah, I'm not really seeing anything. Video enhancements and stuff. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not. I'm not seeing anything. So, whatever. Like, it's not. It's not a big deal. I'll just. I'll. As much as it kind of sucks, I'll just use. Well, it doesn't suck. It's still gonna look good. I just wanted to see what it would look like on the PC. But I'll just. I'll just play Zero on GameCube. It's not a big deal. It also. So I did see a thing though about restoring 
the GameCube's lighting? I don't know if the lighting's different. I guess maybe it is. But I have no idea. The lighting still looks really good to me. So if the game does have any issues that are different from the GameCube with its lighting, I certainly can't see it. I can't tell. Nope. Guess we got the sword key. Now, do I wish to heal? I could, but I also don't think I really care enough. But I could, though. Like, I had more than enough health by the end of that. Let's see where the zombie is. Well, I also do have a defensive item, so you know what? We're fine. Yeah, there you go. See, we're fine no matter what. We're good. We're good. De didn't even scare me. Didn't even scare me. No sweat. <laughs> see, and uh, see, I don't know, though. I don't know. So like, now thinking about it, I mean... Like, I could... See, I could still... I could... St so, I don't know if Zero still has the same issues. I'm guessing it does, but I don't really know. But I probably could just get through it, as in, like, deal with... Like, assuming it does, I could still just get through it and still take the double damage from getting grabbed. I don't think that's still... I don't think that's bad. Why does that look cracked already? Oh shit me. Okay. <laughs> okay, that okay, that that spooked me a little bit. That got me game. That got me. I'll give you that. That got me a little bit. Oh. I don't know. I'll probably test out zero. I'll, I'll test zero. I'll, I'll play like the opening bit and then I'll just decide from there if it still has the same issues or not. We will see. Um. With dirty water, I will remove the plug. <laughs> Bleh. See, so Chris doesn't automatically kill the zombie. See, that's another difference with Chris. I, I will say Chris's mode is harder. It is for sure the harder, the harder playthrough. Okay, so that's the armor key. Nah, I, I mean, if there are zombies in here, I'll just kill them. Which I believe there are, yeah. Well, I'm, yeah, I guess this ones actually aren't that bad. Because I remember the trick now. Yeah, you're supposed to kill these guys on the stairs. Okay, so we'll, we'll kill these zombies. Because these ones are annoying. These ones are pieces of garbage. 
pieces of poo poo. And I'm gonna get to burn them anyway, so. Still in the clear. Still in the clear. We'll just deal with this one now. All right, come this way, buddy. Got to lure you onto the zombie pile. Okay, well, I guess he didn't count. He doesn't get to go on the pile with his friends. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, so now we have the struggle of what to put away. Well, this, that's not so much of a struggle. Uh, we'll take the F-8. Now, do I keep the handgun ammo? Oh yeah, Chris also gets the lighter just automatically, so that's so burning zombies is actually easier as Chris, interestingly enough. Oh, yeah, just same thing. I'm gonna assume I've read every note already. I'll just use it. All right, Chris, burn him. Man, how must that smell? That probably doesn't smell very good. It's like, man, what would that smell like? Actually, like rotting, like burning, rotting flesh. That probably doesn't smell too good. Probably wouldn't smell too good in the slightest. It's probably turbo gross, in fact. Oh, that was a key. That wasn't an ink ribbon? I thought that was an ink ribbon. Oh, well. Okay, my bad. I'll take the key. I just need to remember every ink ribbonable door. Uh, do I get rid of the handgun ammo? I think I do. See, I could kill the zombies in that one room. But, but they're so easy to dodge, though, that it's kind of like, well, why? But they're easy to dodge as... Well, well, I don't know. They should still be easy to dodge as Chris, right? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. The door up here. It's locked. Emblem of armor. The door is not locked, but I can get a. I can get a map. No, no, I can't. I can't get the map yet. I can get it soon. Oh, I can take this though. Give me another full heal, please and thank you. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Hmm. I think Chris also takes more damage. I mean, I double damage might negate that. That might that might be negated, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But Chris is, Chris supposedly 
can take more damage than Jill can. And you have some people that ask why. Like, why can Chris take more damage? You can see it in the character model, interestingly enough, right? He has more armor. He has way more armor than Jill does. Um... And in the same vein, like, oh, how can Jill carry more? She has a head pouch. You, you can see it. It's actually really clever how they did it. Like, it, it's it's actually really smart how they showed it off in the character design. Okay, I'll put the herb away. I have the dog whistle. Hmm. Hmm. So the dog whistle, how do I get out there again? Do I just take the handgun ammo? I don't know. I'm debating it. I'm heavily debating it. I'm debating if I just take the handgun ammo or not. But then I'm out, like... Oh, but I need to kill the dogs. Eh, I need to kill the dogs. I'll take it. I guess I go through that whole way up there. That's probably the best way to do it, right? Probably. Because I need to get back to the main hallway entrance. And I know I can use the sword key up there. Yeah, okay. Okay. Because I remember I was dumb. And I didn't realize that that was a sword key door. I don't think there are any sword key doors here. No, there wouldn't be. I'm not missing any sword key doors, right? I'm probably forgetting one at least. Oh yeah, I should also use this, shouldn't I? Yeah, use this first. Get it out of the way. I might need to examine it first. I don't know. We'll see. Now, how long will it take for me to complete Chris's story? See, that's the that's the question here. I don't think it'll take me as long as eight hours, like what Jill did. Uh, and if you're wondering what the old keys are for, by the way, they're basically uh, the lockpick replacement. That's kind of the thing with Chris as well, right? Like, Chris has the lighter, but Jill gets the lockpick. So she can just unlock any door that Chris needs a small key for. Or an old key, I guess they're called. Can't get in there yet. Can't get in here yet. No armor. You use the mansion key. That's also a sword key door. I completely forgot about that. So this might be the last sword key door. Maybe. Tis not. Uh, but I'm trying to think where the other one would be then. I don't remember where it is. It might be the one out here, maybe? Unless that's a, a lockpick lock, which it might be. You might be able to unlock it with an old key, yeah. Use the old key. Alright, do I go out there and deal with the doggos then? Or do I deal with the zombies in here first? Eh, deal with doggos. Deal with doggos. Get them out of the way. Hmm. 
Because they might they might kill me, but I'm hoping they don't, especially if I just camp here. You blew the dog whistle. Oh damn it. Now that was my controller. That was my control stick. Oh my god. I mean, I don't really, well, I don't need to come back out here, but I guess I could just let the dogs live. Yeah, fine. That dog can live. You don't need the dog whistle anymore. Discard. Yeah, because I don't, well, I mean, yeah, of course, but I, I was debating going through the other door, but I don't ever really come back out here, do I? And if I do, I come in through this door because it's just quicker, really. Okay, whatever. That one door will forever remain unlocked, I guess. Or locked, even. Give me the coin, please, that I examine again to turn into... Boom! A fake key. Nice. I love zombies on stairs, dude. They're so easy to just, like, get around. Mm. Okay, he's still alive, technically. Is he? There he is. Okay, I think he's touching. I think he's touching the corpse of, of his fallen comrade. Oh, yeah, there's a zombie. Let's go. Oh, no. Okay, he's still alive. He's still alive. That's good. That's good. I, I can't kill him too far away. There we go. That'll do it. Now, are there any more around? There is like one more, right? I think there is. Wait, what? Did he get back up? Okay, well, whatever. He's a non-issue anyway, I guess. Oh, is there really no more? I guess not. Oh, okay. Okay, fine then. Fine then. Go ahead and dispose of these guys really quick. Yeah. All right, cool. Uh, now what, though? Now what? So I have the fake armor key. I know where to go for that. But do I ditch anything else in here? Mm. So there's like an ink ribbon here, right? No, there isn't. I could have swore. But I, I said that last time too, didn't I? I've changed color. Is there really anything else in this room? No, there isn't. Hmm. hmm. Okay. Well, mm. it didn't burn you. Are you for real? You didn't get burned? Oh my God. Well, that's not good. Well, I need to come back for him, I guess, before he turns. Well, you know what? Yeah, we'll just go in here. Fuck it, we'll just go in here. We'll go in here and we'll get the kerosene and we'll burn him. Why not, right? Man, I thought I did that perfectly.
Oh, and I got the fake shotgun. Nice. Yeah, so that's Chris's special uh, defense weapon. It's a hand grenade. It's pretty cool. Okay, let's go take care of the zombie. I don't want any crimson heads. If I can avoid a crimson head, I will gladly do that. Because, uh, yeah, crimson heads kind of suck. They kind of suck a lot. I'm so sad it didn't burn him. I'm so sad. You know, and it, if, if there's, like, any neighbors outside that hear me say that, they'll probably think I'm a psycho, but... It's like, man, I'm so sad that I didn't burn him. So let me think on the course of action here. So I burn the zombie. I put the fuel canteen back. I'm not going to go through there yet because I don't really need to. Oh, I could unlock... Um, I could unlock the way outside. I don't think... That's not a... That's not an old key door, right? I think that's a... I think that's a sword key door, I think. So I could go do that. Hmm. could go do that mm, but mm, that means i gotta go back quite a ways well i guess not really i guess i don't need to go back too far because i would like to get the shotgun i would like to get the shotgun Yeah, okay, let's see. So if we can go through this door, then I think I'm in the clear. If I can't, then it's okay, because I'd, I'd just run back. Not a big deal. Okay, it's locked. So that's an armor door. I can get the armor key. Ooh, but if I'm going to get that, then that means a crimson head will be there, and I don't have the shotgun yet. So that's how they get you with Chris, right? Because I don't have the shotgun yet, but if I go to get the armor key, the crimson head will show up. So, best way for me to go for that is kind of to go through the dog hallway. Because then I can take care of a few things. But I don't really have the space for a lot of stuff. I, I, I guess I'll move the ammo. I guess I'll... Yeah, that's probably the best thing to do. Probably put the ammo away. Because ideally, I get rid of this key soon, and I replace it with another key. I could also go gunless if I really wanted to, I guess. I guess I could risk that biscuit, but... I don't really want to... Like, I think this is fine... Because I'm going to get rid of this one, I'm going to get rid of this one and replace it with another key. I'm going to get rid of this, replace it with a shotgun, and probably some shells. Probably, I think there are shells in that room, so... I think I'm in the clear. My only issue is going to be getting around those dogs. And I'm going to need to pick up the... The, um... the um poison plant killer so that's the thing if i wake the crimson head up here then i'm a little bit a little bit screwed i don't think i will yeah okay because i'm pretty sure he triggers on the camera switch when you go up to get the armor key like i said before i'm pretty sure he's the only scripted crimson head well besides the boss but 
We don't really count the boss. Oh, there's handgun ammo here. Oh, hey there. Oh, well, shoot. I, um, made a bit of a mistake then, didn't I? Uh, it's fine. It's fine. Is it? Yeah, right. Right? It's fine. I could... I could just not get the fertilizer, I guess. But I should. Because I'm going to get the key. And having the fertilizer is good when you take the key. Because then you can open up that one door. And then you can use the fertilizer and then get all the goodies. Uh... So I might need to go through that door twice. The, the one that breaks. I might need to go through that one a couple times. Mm, okay, I'm, I'm debating in my head what what my best course of action would be, like what my best route would be. Okay, I guess they're not triggered yet. I'm gonna wait and see if there's a zombie in here, and then I'm gonna take a sip, because I feel like I'm gonna need it. Here's something clear. It's locked. Okay, so that's that's an old key door. That's not awful. But I guess I'm not getting rid of the sword key then. So where's the last sword key door? You know, I don't actually know where the last sword key door is. All right, so we take you. Swap that out with you. Let me have a look. So the sword key. So... That one... Oh, oh, it's, it's the one that leads to the basement. That's right. Look, the door I never check. Did I take the shotgun? Yeah. Are there any shells in here? I guess maybe there aren't. I thought there were. Nothing of interest here. Nah. Okay, I guess that's it. Well, I guess the best thing for me to do then would be to get rid of the sword key by going in and unlocking that one bit. Which isn't hard to do. Although that one zombie is going to be a pain. Unless I kill it with the shotgun. And get a headshot. Which I could do. I could hope for that. And then I can just burn it. So if I don't if I don't blow off its head with a shotgun, I I just kind of go around and I hope it doesn't become a crimson head. By the time I wrap around so I can burn it, I guess. I guess that's the plan. I can't really think of any other plan, so I guess we'll just go with that one. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll do that. We'll do that. Worst comes to worst, I have one more crimson head to burn, and worst comes to worst, I maybe lose, like, a shot on the crimson head. As long as I have three shotgun shells, I think that's all I need.
And I do want to get rid of my sword key. I don't want to hold on to it for too much longer. I have I have such little space as is. Now I would just rather not. I would just rather not. All right, let's get Chris all decked out. There we go. And yeah, I didn't have that sip that I wanted to have. Let's go ahead and have it. Ah, perfect. Ah, perfect. Excellent, excellent. All right, zombie, as revenge for killing our dear Kenneth. Look at him. Look how creepy he looks, too. It's such a good scene. It really, really is. God, this game is beautiful in so many ways. Okay, good. We got revenge. And it only took one shot. Emblem of armor. Swap back to that. Check that key on out of here. Oh no, there's something in here. I was gonna say, I don't remember there being anything in here, but I guess a small key. I want you so I can go and do the thing that I need to do. Hmm. I don't know if I like that there's already a zombie vibing in here. I guess another one is here for Chris. Yeah, there is. It's a crawler, too. Of course it is. Ah, oh, you bastard. Okay, that's fine. All good. All good. No concerns. And I think I still have, yeah, I still have one more dagger. And then I have, like, a flashbang, but, eh, don't worry about that. So now, actually, I could just go this way. Uh, but I should also, but I need to get... But I do need to get the fertilizer, though. I keep calling it fertilizer. It, it's plant poison or whatever. It, it's a bad thing for plants. It, it's a kill plant item. I do need that. Hmm. I don't need it, but I... Sh no, no, I do need it, actually. I do need that. You dead? No way. No, you're not. I see three shots. Three shots is all it takes. Ah. Eh, yeah, whatever. You can live, I guess. Uh, picking up that herb was kind of a problem, wasn't it? Oh, uh, well. It's not too big of a deal. I have easy access to an item box anyway, so it's not really a big deal. Not really. It's like a minor annoyance, if anything. Do I want to just go and get the fertilizer? If I do that, then I'm going to need to clear out my inventory. Because I'm going to need space. Uh, I mean, it's not a bad thing to do. 
I guess. I guess I'll do that. I'll save soon. I'll save soon. So I need to make the big run. Yeah, even move a little bit faster without your weapons, I think, so. So if I'm going to do the big run, I need to... I guess I should pick up the gem, too. I should probably pick up the blue gem while I'm going by. I mean, it's going to take a, a slot, but... Hey, bud. It's going to take a slot, but I mean, eh, I guess what's the big deal, right? And I'm going down the area anywhere I'm going to need the blue gem, so... Yeah, I'll grab it. I'll grab it. Like I said, it doesn't take that much space away from me. Grab you. Now let's hope I won't die. I should save soon. I will probably save soon. Uh, I'll save probably after I'm done with the plants. After I'm done getting all those herbs. I'll probably save then. That's still a little bit risky. It's still a little bit dangerous, but I think I think I can swing it. Doug was probably going to be too happy with me, though. Really? Really? Not yet, huh? Hmm. I'm shocked. Calling me surprised. Yeah, let's go ahead and use this old key. Get it out of here. Then I can get the plant poison, pick up all the herbs out here, hopefully avoid doggies. I'll look at all the herbs, dude. Look at all of them. It's like they're waiting for me. Oh, there's kerosene out here, too. Well, yeah, maybe I should have brought my kerosene bottle. Nah, I didn't know. Well, I should have. The boiler, or a boiler. The humidity has caused it to rust. That's ah, chemical to use on plants. Okay, so it's a chemical, not a fertilizer. We didn't even have any dog bites. Look at that. Dude, look at that. We're lucky. We're getting lucky here. I think the whole area's cleaned out now. Yeah. Not even that hard to avoid either. Man, look how fast Chris goes. You go so fast when you don't have weapons. Oh! Well, shoot. That's really unfortunate. That's okay. Ah, oh, there you go. Okay, that's especially unfortunate. I didn't think it exploded. I didn't think it exploded. I didn't think it would... Shoot. So... So normally... I need... Well, normally I thought you had to shoot it. With a gun. To get it to explode. I guess they just explode by themselves. I've never actually gone completely gunless when I've had to use a flashbang, I guess. Takita says I'm not seeing anyone else's comments. Is my chat room? Is my chat frozen? Nah, just been a bit of a slow day today. Which is always perfectly fine. Mm. Let's go ahead and throw this in here. A slow day in terms of like chatters, I should say. Uh so go ahead and we'll throw this in here. So that does suck though, that I lost 
like a good portion of my health from that. That was a bit of a mistake. Okay, so what do I have for heals? So I have a full heal on me, which I don't want to use. Uh, I don't want to use it, but meh. But if I get bitten once, I'm, I might actually be dead. It depends on how the game goes. I guess. I could just drop a save and then not save again for a while. Okay, so what do I have? Let's do let's do a health check. So I have one full heal. One full heal. Two full heal. So I have two full heals and, well, a, a double, I guess. Eh, it's not too good, in my opinion. I don't really like that very much. I don't really like that very much. Especially I'm going to be taking stupid mistakes. Okay, says, oh, okay, this game is so cozy. It is really cozy. It's really nice. Really, really nice. I like it. See, as Chris, I only saved nine times in my first playthrough. So let's see if we can cut that down even more. Now, granted, I'm already at risk of death. So, you know, not not the best. Um, I guess I'll take these. I don't really want to take a heal item yet. I, I want to have more. I need the imitation key. Yeah, because I can pick up the armor key. I can use the imitation key. I know where to use the gemstone and I know where to use the fertilizer. So I'm pretty much in the clear, I think. I think I might, and I don't really need to kill those zombies in that room either. Mm. So best way to get back there would be, well, this way, probably. And let's hope we don't get bitten. Because once again, a bite could mean death, and I would like to avoid that. I would really like to avoid that. Ah, see, the one problem is I'm not going to have enough space to carry all the herbs back, I don't think. Like, even... Uh, maybe I should... Well, okay, 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 okay. Maybe what I'll do... Is I will... Maybe I'll ditch my ammo again. Maybe I'll ditch my ammo. Maybe I'll keep my pistol. Or maybe I'll ditch the pistol. I might do that. See, it's weird how so viable that is on Chris. Just like, well, get rid of your handguns. Get rid of your weapons if you know you're going to be carrying a lot. So, okay, you know. I guess fair. God, I feel so bad that I took that explosive grenade damage. I thought it wouldn't do it. I guess the idea is the zombie bites down on it enough and then it, it explodes. I guess you don't need to shoot it with a pistol. I think it just makes it happen automatically. Like it just makes it happen sooner if you shoot it with a pistol. Okay, we take the real key that goes down. Oh no, what's this? There's a trap here in this mansion. Oh no. There's a dude with spinny armor coming to kill me. Oh, let's go ahead and just save that then. How long do you think it took them to build this mansion with all these traps? Like, there's so many traps in this mansion. Mm. 
Yeah, get rid of the pistol, I guess. Howdy, zombie. And go in here, drop off the weaponry. And yeah, just go weaponless for with Chris for a bit, I guess. I'm pretty sure I did this in the first time I streamed this too. I I don't know. I know I have it up. I know it, it's still saved on the Twitch channel. So I'm pretty sure I did this with Chris too. I might have even done this with the original. A bit more. I don't recall. I don't recall. Oh, I'm gonna need to shave. You need to shave soon. I can feel like my my facial hair like getting into my nose. It's locked. Well, isn't I I put away the key. I put away the key. Why why would I do that? I want to keep the key game and me talk to past me. I want to keep the, the key on me. Okay, let's go. Where did I put the key? Here it is. Don't know why I put it away. That that clearly my brain decided no, I want inventory space, and it was like no, clear out everything. You don't need the key. No game, I do. I do need the key. I really, really want the key. In fact. I mean, those feel so itchy too. Must my nose have that itchy feeling? Oh, here you go. And take one of these. I'm so glad this room is safe and then I never need to come back in here like ever again. Well, I do. It's just later. I will take the shotgun shells, please. And please do not deposit snakes on me again, oh great tiger statue of wisdom. I'm going in that room too. What's in that room again? I mean, I can unlock this door at least. What's in here? I hope it's not a danger room. Oh, it is actually. It is a danger room. Uh. I mean, is it? It is a danger room, but I think I'll be fine. We'll see. Yeah, I'll take this. I'll, I'll take the old key. Oh. Oh, look at that. Oh, legends. Absolute legends. Look at that. Yes. Now that, now that was what we call skillful gameplay. I may not have been very skilled in various aspects of this game, but that one was actually pretty, pretty good. I think, I think I did pretty good. So I want to use the red one, I believe. Go ahead and slap you in. You know, a bit of a realization. Oh, I guess I could heal with it, to be fair. I guess I could pick up all the herbs if I just heal with some. If I need to. I don't know if I need to. I might. I might need to, actually. Yeah, I'm, I'm probably going to need to. I need to heal. I'll I'll cut myself some slack here. I do actually need to heal. 